it's me, Mrs. T for Veda Day 17. And today I'm just gonna do a one take. I'm using the SSS Veda prompts, which was what was your favorite year of school? And I think most people probably would say like high school years or whatever. But for me, honestly, my favorite year of school was eighth grade. I loved eighth grade. It was like the beginning of my feeling more like a teenager. I turned 13 that year and I got to not necessarily hang out outside of school, but we had like the big kid field trips where we took the bus for like more than 20 minutes away from the school. Um, we had a dance. We were able to do like little school things that other kids weren't able to do. Like the eighth graders could set up the chairs. The eighth graders could um, hang out in the the gym longer than everybody else. So it was just like the little eighth grade perks that we got that kind of made that year really awesome. And then the thing that topped it off for me was at my eighth grade graduation. I went to Catholic school. So our graduations were like big deals. We had caps, gowns, the co honor cords, and our graduation was in the school. I mean, the church that was across the street from my school. It was really huge and just like nice. And we got to walk down the aisle. It was just really, really nice. It had a lot of ceremony to it, but it was in a good way. And what happened for me at the graduation ceremony was like, even though I knew I was a good student, I always had like A's and B's and made A and B honor rolls. So it wasn't ever like I was like a bad student. But at graduation, they didn't really tell anybody ahead of time what honors they were getting or if you were getting honors or whatever. So when we sat down and they started doing like specific area or class honors, they call my name first for science. And I was like, oh, this is kind of cool. I like science. I knew I was good in science. So I get up and they were giving out medals, like little tassels with medals on the end of them. So I got that and I walk, I make, you had to walk like all the way back around to come back to your seat. So I make my way around and just when I got back to my seat, I heard my name being called for, I think it was English. And I was like, hmm, okay. So I made my way back up, get the English medal, come back around and then they were calling me for history. And I was like, okay, this is getting kind of weird. Like, am I getting something for every area and they had not said anything to me so my family is like losing it at this point they're like woo, like screaming the principal who was a um a nun was like shh telling everybody to hush yeah they weren't hushing so everybody's screaming and stuff and i ended up walking away i think with four or five honors medals that i did not expect to receive and so for me that kind of just like made my eighth grade year and it was the best way i could ever think of to leave the school because when the eighth graders got to come back while the other kids were still in school everyone was like oh that's tiffany and she got i, I thought i was famous i was like Catholic school famous for about a week and it was kind of awesome. So for me, that's my Veda Day 17 <laughs> answer that eighth grade was my very best year as far as my school years. Um, now I will be back. I will be back. I will be back tomorrow for Veda Day 18. Not sure if I'm doing a prompt or just like a vlog with me type thing, but do not change this channel. You want to know why? I just loaded up my April glam bag Ipsy reveal. I don't peek. So you guys are seeing my bag right along with me on camera. And let me just tell you, I got a couple items that are pretty cool. And one that I've been trying to get for a minute and I'm like so stoked that it was in the bag. So make sure you guys check that out. It's already loaded so you guys can check it out below in the upload section. Also, tonight I'm getting ready to go to Monster Jam 2015. That's right folks. Where the big trucks with the big ginormous wheels roll around in the dirt and we get to watch and cheer. And I'm going to be live tweeting and Instagramming and probably vlogging through most of it. So make sure you follow me on Twitter as at Mrs. T-H, M-R-S-T-E-E-H. You'll see it at the end of this as well. And make sure you follow me on Instagram. And it's the same handle at M-R-S-T-E-E-H. Because I'm going to be tweeting tonight from about 7 p.m. to about 10 p.m. when it's over. And it's at the Crown Coliseum or Crown Complex, sorry, Crown Complex in Fayetteville. And I want to share my Fayetteville with you guys. So make sure you stay tuned and stay on this channel. And how do you do that? You thumbs up, like, and subscribe, people. So subscribe so you don't miss out on anything because I'm going to be sharing a lot of stuff with you guys coming up. Okay? I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Smooches.